Hi friends, Joanna here. I hope you guys are all doing amazing. I'm in the middle of doing some um, fabric spring cleanup. So um, what I'm doing is actually going through my fabrics from the fall and winter. And you know, when you're making projects, you have these like weird pieces still sticking out, you know, right? So usually what I do a few times a year is I go through my fabrics and I square them up and I cut off some of these stray pieces here. So that's what I'm actually spending the next couple of days doing. Um, I have a new um, scrap pack available for you guys and it's all about pets. Right? So these are pieces um, left over from little projects that I was making. I have these little uh, book pages here that I was making and makes for a lot of scraps. And these little um, Velcro cord keepers. So cute, right? These were very popular around the holidays and as well as some pattern weights. How cute is that, right? So these I've actually been making in the last couple of days, making some more, All right? These are lots of fun and um, some cute little coasters. I actually made this one for myself because it looks like our, our little guy, Max. So, I just wanted to run through the um, fabrics in this particular scrap pack really super quick if you guys are interested. So there's a lot of nice pieces, bigger pieces here. So see how like this one has a odd size here, but this fabric is absolutely adorable. This I had this fabric um, I had gotten at Walmart and this cute little snail strips. I was using this for binding for um, a quilt that I made. Um, I don't know if I had posted that, but I'm going to remember too. Some uh, cute little kitty, orange and gray. These are our tabbies. So we have an orange and gray two brother tabbies. Uh, we have some kitties, kitty strips. This is everything in this particular scrap pack. So we have this strip, how cute these little guys are, right? Um, some smaller pieces. So these are mostly uh, remnants and smaller pieces like strips, squares, and some rectangles, right? So we have some cute little monkeys. I actually um, use those and these little this llama fabric for our cell phone pillows. I'm in the middle of making some more for our store. So we have some smaller pieces for the llamas, right? This was at Joanne's, obviously. Some nice size pieces. How cute for a little pencil case for a kid, right? So, yeah. Some nice size pieces. Um, I obviously have to um, press these and then trim them up better but um cute little gray and white doggies I only have one little piggy strip I think but these make for great great small projects some more sweater monkeys these are just adorable love that some more kitties that was at Walmart these have all been either Walmart or Joanne so this one from Walmart to these um, beautiful doggies. So these are nice size pieces, right? Some more, I love this fabric because I like the different pops of color. So those are nice size pieces. I have a little dinosaur piece left over. I love those little dinosaurs. Some strips for paws. I was making a um, blanket, so um, I use these for bindings. The paws are cute. Some more paws. 
little heart paws are really cute. Black and white paws. I like these if you're making like a little bag or something. I like, you know, using the animal fabric. I like the paws to, to use. I like to use um, them for the lining fabrics. And how adorable are these kitties, right? With the little butterfly. The kitties in the garden. Some, I will have some more fox fabric. So that's a nice size piece. A little strip here. I don't know what happened to this piece in the fabric. It got a little, I don't know, weird. It's not a salvage edge, obviously. It was something that went right down here. But nice size piece, strip here. How cute these kitties are. Right, nice big piece. You can make a little um, lunch bag, a little makeup bag. Um, you know, a little tiny purse for a little one. Very cute. Have some dinosaurs here. Um, nice size pieces. I love the bold patterns on these. This was Walmart as well. Um, these come by the yard as well as they also sell these in Fat Quarters. I like the Fat Quarters because I like to not have to buy a whole yard of something. Some more big pieces right here. That's a really nice. This would be such a cute lip if you made like a a little um, pencil case, right? For a kid, this would be a little big for a pencil case, but you can cut it down and have your images here. So cute. Love these. Love, love, love. And then some just basic, a little piece of the paws and the bones. So that's it for this scrap pack, but it's a really nice... Um, a nice lot for anyone who wants to make um like i always say i love to you have the um smaller pieces because you can like I said make so many different things with them right coasters mug rugs you know you know somebody who likes to read who loves you know maybe um, a grandparent who loves to read they love animals they love kitties or whatever this is a nice little gift for them um everyone has cords all around the house, everywhere, right? I have these little cord keepers everywhere. We have them in all our drawers and because we all have cords everywhere. And these are pattern weights, but you you know, the kids can use them because they're kind of fun. You know, they're really super cute. I have a lot of people that buy these just for the um, kids to play. So they're very versatile, but Anyway, so thank you so much for watching. I just wanted to share with you our new uh, scrap pack that I had just listed. And um, thank you guys again for everything, for all of your support over, it's been almost a year now. So thank you for your support. Please subscribe, um, like, and make some comments. Let me know what you guys think about these fabrics, how cute they are. Um... Actually, let me know which one your favorite is because I, I don't know. I, I don't really know if I have a favorite, but I do. I am partial to the kitties, but I love that this fabric. But anyway, thank you again so much for watching. Um, I hope everyone um, is enjoying your spring. And um, I will be talking to you soon because we have lots of great things to make. So thank you so much. And I, again, I will be talking to you guys soon. Thanks.